Hey friends, welcome to One Little Coder. In this video, we're going to see how can you set up your R Studio in such a way that you can export your R Markdown or R Notebook as a PDF. So by default, you would not have this capability unless until you have Latex Manager, Text Manager installed. So let's first try to see what we can do uh, in the current setup. So let's go ahead and create an R Markdown and um, let's name it um, my first PDF and you can see that I have, uh, I have my R Markdown and I'm trying to knit it. When I try to knit it, it's asking me to save it, my first PDF. And then you can see that uh, it says um, the error is that uh, we don't have any no latex installation uh, detected. So you have to do something. So you have a lot of options. For example, if you are on Linux, you have to use Linux manager. If you're on Mac OS, you have to install Mac text from this page, which is a lot of GBs. And if you are on Windex, Windows, you have to use MIG text. But the, the, there is one very easy option where you don't have to do all of this is to use this package called tiny text. So let's first go ahead and see about tiny text. Tiny text is a package by Yuhi. Yuhi is quite popular in our community for uh, his contributions to our studio. Um, so you can actually see that uh, this is a package that will help you install all the uh, components of um, um, text manager or, or the essential components of text manager without um, let's say admin rights or anything. So let's first install uh, tiny text. Uh, so it's available on CRAN, so you can simply install tiny text. Once you install the package, it's uh, still getting installed. Once you install the package, uh, you can actually see that uh, you have to invoke this function, uh, install tiny text from tiny text. So let's install tiny text. This process would take a couple of minutes. So as you can see that it has started a shell script. Now it is uh, trying to install all the essential uh, text manager component for uh, your um, PDF, for your R Markdown to convert it to a PDF using uh, text. So let's wait for the installation to happen. So it has taken more than a few minutes than I thought. Uh, as you can see, tiny text has been successfully installed. Um, it's actually a text manager. So now let us go ahead and try the same thing that we tried before. So let's specifically knit. So you can see what what are we trying to knit. Uh, so we are trying to knit it as a PDF document. So knit as PDF. And you can see that it is creating all the necessary files. And then finally it's going to use the .txt file under our markdown to render uh, this document as a PDF. So looks like it is happening. Let's uh, wait for a few more minutes and you can see that your first PDF has been successfully knitted and uh, it didn't take a lot of time. It didn't uh, take uh, your uh, bandwidth of downloading GBs of uh, text manager, which is actually a big mess. And even after you install that, you have to install a lot of individual components. So a huge shout out and thanks to Yuhi for making this tiny text R package that makes it ridiculously simpler for you to install uh, text manager on your machine and then successfully um, export uh, R Markdown as PDF. So I hope this video was helpful for you and uh, if you have any comments please let me know. Uh, see you in the next video.